A Woman's Answer by Adelaide Anne Proctor Read for LibriVox.org by Ruth Golding I will not let you say a woman's part must be to give exclusive love alone. Dearest, although I love you so, my heart answers a thousand claims beside your own. I love, what do I not love? Earth and air find space within my heart, and myriad things you would not deign to heed are cherished there, and vibrate on its very inmost strings. I love the summer, with her ebb and flow of light and warmth and music, that have nursed her tender buds to blossoms, and you know, it was in summer that I saw you first. I love the winter dearly too, but then I owe it so much. On a winter's day, bleak, cold and stormy, you returned again, when you had been those weary months away. I love the stars like friends, so many nights I gazed at them when you were far from me, till I grew blind with tears, those far-off lights could watch you whom I longed in vain to see. I love the flowers, happy hours lie shut up within their petals close and fast. You have forgotten, dear, but they and I keep every fragment of the golden past. I love, too, to be loved. All loving praise seems like a crown upon my life to make it better worth the giving, and to raise still nearer to your own the heart you take. I love all good and noble souls. I heard one speak of you but lately, and for days, only to think of it, my soul was stirred in tender memory of such generous praise. I love all those who love you, all who owe comfort to you, and I can find regret even for those poorer hearts who once could know and once could love you and can now forget. Well, is my heart so narrow, I who spare love for all these? Do I not even hold my favourite books in special tender care, and prize them as a miser does his gold? The poets that you used to read to me, while summer twilights faded in the sky. But most of all, I think, Aurora Lee, because, because, do you remember why? Will you be jealous? Did you guess before I loved so many things? Still you the best. Dearest, remember that I love you more. Oh, more a thousand times than all the rest. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain.